भगीरथी सुख दायिनी मात है तब जल महिमाकार भूत भव्य भवत प्रभु भूतपूर्व भूतपूर्व भाव भूतत्ता भूत भावना Haridwar is better known as the temple city of India. This red color temple is Sri Vishnu temple, one of the many temples on the banks of River Ganga. River Ganga is considered as the most sacred river of India as per Hindu belief bathing in the river washes away all your sins and purifies your body and soul Devi Sureshwari भगवती गंगे देवी सुरेश्वरी भगवती गंगे त्रिभुवन तारिणी तरल तरंगे त्रिभुवन तारिणी तरल तरंगे शंकर मणि विहारिणी भीमे शंकर मणि It was July 2007. We visited Haridwar with mom. The journey was very exciting as we had planned to visit Chardham from Haridwar. This is a branch of River Ganga known as Ganga Canal. The water of this branch is regulated by a dam to ensure that it doesn't exceed the banks and cause damage. This branch of Ganga is made purposefully for bathing, puja and other religious activities. As Haridwar is an important Hindu religious place you will find many sadhus saints and hermits here in Haridwar <laughs>
on this side of the river it is the haridwar township which is full of hotels dharmasalas and ashrams There are many bridges on the river for the convenience of the people to go from one side to the other. This location is called Harki Pauri. This is the most important place on the banks of River Ganga. There are many important temples located at this place. This place is always crowded with thousands of devotees. This is Harki Pauri the most important location of Haridwar There is a group of small temples located at this place such as Mahakali Temple Bhairav Temple Hanuman Temple Ganga Mata Temple Bhagirathi Temple Lakshmi Narayana Temple and many more There are beautiful platforms on both the sides of River Ganga and it is very pleasant to take a long walk on the banks of the river. Hello, sir. Hello. 
This is a huge Shiva statue in Vivekananda Park about half kilometer north from Harkipaudi because of its height it is visible from Harkipaudi and from many other places in Haridwar Every evening there is Aarti celebration of Ma Ganga near Harkipaudi. The place becomes crowded with thousands of devotees and the environment is vibrated with ghanta, ghanta and prayers. Next morning mom and i were set ready to take bath in river ganga there are many sacred bathing huts in haridwar on the banks of river ganga as per hindu religion it's very auspicious to take bath in these sacred ghats There are steps and barricades for the safety of people. People can hold the barricades while bathing in order to protect themselves from the mighty current of the water. It was a great pleasure and spiritual satisfaction to take bath in river Ganga both for me and for my mom as per hindu belief the purpose of coming to haridwar becomes complete only after taking bath in this sacred river chandra se jyot tumhari jal nirmal aata ayo jal nirmal aata शरण पड़े जो तेरी शरण पड़े जो तेरी सोनर तर जाता ओम जय गंगे माता आज यू कैन सी द करेंट ऑफ द वाटर वॉज एक्सट्रीमली स्ट्रॉन्ग इट वॉज वेरी डिफिकल्ट टू स्टैंड इन द वाटर आई कू नॉट गो बियॉन्ड द सेकेंड स्टेप as the water was literally pushing me away
ପଡ଼ିବେ ମା After taking bath in the river mom went back to the water to do some prayers tarpan namaskar and other religious activities although the water was dirty and muddy i was surprised to see her drinking a stomach full of water this shows the level of faith of people on this sacred river As we stayed for more than 10 days in Haridwar we explored different routes leading to river Ganga and also explored various statues temples and other attractions on the route this was a beautiful Shiva statue in a park on the road side This was Makara Vahini Ganga temple on the banks of river Ganga. We got free prasad in this temple. This was Dukha Harana Hanuman temple and Sankat Mochan Hanuman temples near the banks of river Ganga. Floating of the burning candle in the river is a common religious practice in Haridwar. Chandra se jyot hai tumhari jal nirmal aata Maya jal nirmal aata Sharan pade jo teri Sharan pade jo teri सोनर तर जाता ओम जय गंगे माता चलती है मेरी देखे देखिए
It was the month of Shravan. Thousands of Kauriyas were carrying the holy water to different Shiva temples in the country. This is Brahmakunda, the most sacred bathing hut of Haridwar. Thousands of devotees take bath here on every day. Mom had a wish to take bath here in Brahmakunda, so we came prepared. As per the mythology, the nectar fell here from the heaven at this spot of Harkipodi in Haridwar. That is why this spot is called Brahmakunda. This is the most sacred ghat of Haridwar. The person bathing here washes away all her sins, not only of this birth but also of all her previous births. तब जन मात स्रोत स्नात तब जन मात स्रोत स्नात पुनरपि जठ रे सोपिन जात पुनरपि जठ रे सोपिन जात नरक निवारिणी जान Mansa Devi Temple is located on top of a hill. You can climb Mansa Devi Hill through the steps or book a ticket in the ropeway known as Mansa Devi Wooden Khatola. We preferred the ropeway which took about 10 minutes to take us to the top of the hill. कितने ऊपर कुछ लेने? हाँ कितने रखते हैं? ये फूलों। We were flying on top of the houses and trees. 
it was giving a breathtaking view of the surroundings including river ganga and the haridwar city ketta vaata uthileni bo ketta vaata uthileni This was the ropeway terminal on top of Mansa Devi Hill. We had to take these steps from the ropeway station to go to Mansa Devi Temple. Mansa means wish. It is believed that the devotees who come here fulfill all their wishes. as the name of this hill is billo parbat this is also known as billo tirtha this is considered as one of the five tirthas of haridwar After having darshan of Mansa Devi we took the rope way again to come down from the hill Pehle bo ja ko se ghar ko jaa charge kar ke aise bachche Hello The length of the rope way was 540 meters taking to the height of 180 meters It was a great enjoyment to see the sceneries from the rope way cabin There are four important Shakti Pithas in Haridwar. Those are Mansa Devi, Maya Devi, Chandi Devi, and Anjana Devi. After visiting Mansa Devi Temple, we also visited the three other Shakti Pithas. This is Maya Devi Temple at the heart of the city. It is surrounded by buildings from all sides and generally difficult to locate unless you ask the local people about the route and entrance. Maya Devi is the Adhishta Tridevi of Haridwar. The deity has three heads and four arms and is believed to be an incarnation of Adi Shakti. Chandi Devi Temple is another important Shakti Pitha. in haridwar the temple is located on top of neel parbat from harki paudi you have to go about 5 kilometers on road and do a trekking of about 3 kilometers to go to the top of the hill As the temple is there on top of the hill you can either go by 3 km trekking or go by Chandi Devi Udan Khatola As trekking was difficult for mom we preferred to go by Udan Khatola
This was the waiting hall of Chandi Devi Udan Khatola. चंडीदेवी रोप वे इज लंगर दैन मनसा देवी रोप वे द लेंथ ऑफ द रोप वे इज अबाउट सेवेन हंड्रेड फोर्टी मीटर्स हुई टेक्स यू टू ए हाइट ऑफ टू हंड्रेड टेन मीटर्स द व्यूज फ्रॉम द रोप वे वे ट्रूली अमेजिंग फाइनली वी लैंडेड ऑन टॉप ऑफ द हिल एट द रोप वे टर्मिनल After getting down from the wooden khatola we had to take some steps and walk little further in order to go to Chandi Devi temple This is the main entrance of Chandi Devi Temple. These are the inside views of Chandi Devi Temple. As the temple is located at a great height you can get a beautiful view of the surroundings including the river bridges road forests mountains etc <laughs> After visiting Chandi Devi Temple, we took a walk to visit Anjani Devi Temple. Anjani Devi Temple is located on the same hill, about half kilometer trekking from Chandi Devi Temple. Maa Bhagwati, आपकी यात्रा सुबह और मंगल में करे, कारोबार में बिजी करे. This is Anjani Devi Temple. Anjani Devi is the mother of Lord Hanuman. We visited the shrines of Lord Hanuman and Anjani Devi here at this place.
के भवन का निर्माण कार्य किया जा रहा है After visiting Chandi Devi Temple and Anjani Devi Temple, we took the rope way again to get down from the Chandi Devi Hill. It was one of the longest rope ways. we had ever seen the views were really superb and we all enjoyed the rope way ride The celebration of Ganga Aarti is a popular event in Harkipaudi. Every day thousands of people gather near Harkipaudi to watch this event in the evenings. <laughs> River Ganga is worshipped as a goddess with ghanta ghanta candles and prayers which becomes a spectacular event every evening as you can see all these people are sitting here to watch the aarti <laughs>
हमारे ज्यादातर के लोग रहते हैं जिनसे आप जानकारी प्राप्त कर सकते हैं अपने बुजुर्गों का रिकॉर्ड देखकर ही रिकॉर्ड दर्ज कराएं या फिर एक बार फिर ध्यान दें हरिद्वार आने पर अपने सिर्फ पर्यटकों के अवसर दिस वॉज द आरती ऑफ रिवर गंगा आज वी वास्ट लाइफ नियर हर की पौड़ी इन हरिद्वार आरती मात तुम्हारी जो मेरे नित गाता जो मेरे नित गाता सकल पाप हरण भव सकल पाप हरण भव सागर तर जाता ओम जय गंगे माता From Haridwar, we went for a local sightseeing package to Rishikesh, Bhimogod, and Kanakhal. This was the Lakshmi Narayana Temple in Kanakhal. <laughs> This was Ma Anandamayi Mahajyoti Pitham in Kanakhal. We also visited Daksha Mahadev Temple, Harihar Ashram, Mercury Shivalinga, Rudraksha Tree, and many other interesting places before going to Rishikesh. <laughs> This was Lakshman Chowk, a famous landmark in Rishikesh. You can see this statue of Lakshman on Lakshman Chowk. Ten paria mangai the. This was Sri Adibadrinath Dwarakadhis Mandir near Lakshmanjula in Rusikes. We were feeling tired while others in our group were visiting handicraft shops we prefer taking rest for some time
This was the famous 13-storied temple on the other side of River Ganga. From there, we took these steps to go to Lakshmanjula. This was Lakshmanjula, the famous hanging breeze on River Ganga in Rusikesh. This was Gita Ashram in Rishikesh. There were many temples inside Gita Ashram. This was Gurudev Samadhi Mandir. There were many idols of gods and goddesses inside this Samadhi Mandir. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama. We crossed the river again to come back from the other side. This was Ramjula, another hanging breeze on River Ganga. We visited Lal Mata Mandir, Vaishnodevi Temple and many other temples in Bhimogod before coming back to Haridwar. <laughs> 